Hi, thank you, Bill, for coming. Um, I really appreciated your letter to. Um, the annual letter? I literally forgot the name. Okay. Um, well, anyway, my name is Jerry. I'm a freshman at the college uh, studying stem cell biology. And uh, my question to you is if you suddenly found yourself to be, uh, say, a sophomore in college at Harvard, what do you think you would uh, study and how do you think you'd uh, spend your time engaging in activities? Well, the thing that you're likely to be world class at is whatever you obsessed over from, say, age 12 to 18. You know, in my case, it was writing software uh, where I would think I was good and then I would meet somebody who would tell me I wasn't and I would look at their code. And I went through four sort of comeuppances of, oh, that's what a really good programmer looks like. And part of the reason I worshiped digital equipment was eventually it was a couple of their very best programmers who came and shared with me how they thought about it, how they did things. And I had studied their code, and, uh, and, that, and there, there were several people who were so key to my doing that. So today, I would go into you know, software, which today that means going into artificial intelligence. Uh, you know, computers still can't read. They, they cannot take a book of information and, say, pass an AP test on that book. And, that's a solvable problem, but it's a knowledge representation problem. And, you know, I've always wanted to solve that problem. Uh, I'm jealous that maybe one of you gets to work on that. I'm, you know, unlikely to go back and be hands-on in that, in that way. But it's the juiciest problem ever. I've thought about it for a long time. Uh, so I, I would go into AI.